All right, thank you for turning into today's Beat with Curly Shack. If you wanna see how I got this beautiful look with these beautiful eyes, oh my gosh, I still cannot get over it. Keep on watching. I am going to be featuring items from JD Glow Cosmetics, as well as the Dusk Palette, Face Palette from Midas Cosmetics and, and Neon MUA. And that's pretty much it. That's what we're doing. We're playing with makeup. Curly Shack is playing with makeup. So if that's something that you'd like to get into, keep on watching. All right, so got my base on. I am going to um, go in with my eyebrow, my eyeshadow primer, eyeshadow primer. All right, let's go in. And I did my base off camera because I wanted to focus on the star of the show, which is my shadows that I got from JD Glow and liners that I got from JD Glow because. Oh, oh, oh. 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 All right. Eyeshadow primer on. And here is what we got from JD Glow. Oh, do y'all see? Do y'all see just in the packaging how it. And we also got this one called Um Oh Oh. See that? See the multi chrome? Oh. So we also got from JD Glow these lovely, lovely liners, gel liners. And oh, oh. I'm trying to figure out how to get the liners to pop with the pretty shadow that I've been waiting all week to slather over my eyebrows, I shot eye, eye lids, not brows, eye lids for you all. Cause look at that. Okay, I'm gonna stop playing with that. Um, and what else are we using today? We are using oh, the Dusk Face Palette mm -hmm. from Midas Cosmetics and Neon MUA. Look at it. Look how pretty. Look how pretty. Look how pretty. So we're using this as well. All right. So to for our shadow base, uh, it's a little one. I'm gonna also use the Power palette from Colored Rain because. There's some purples in here that I'll go with that purple and I'm going to use one of the liners that shifts purple and we're going to have a purple good time. I told y'all you're going to see a lot of purple on this channel. You're going to see a lot of purple on this channel. All right. All right. All right. All right. And I don't know why I keep all the plastic. I, I just do. Right. And here's the for those who didn't know, this is the Power Palette. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it gorgeous? All right. And actually, I think I am, hmm, I am going to go and get my Pat McGrath Labs Single Shadow in um, Burnished Honey. Oh, that'll be a good transition. I'm gonna get all right. Came back with Burnished Honey from Pat McGrath Labs. I love this one. I wanna put that on the inner crease. All right, I'm gonna go with, um, we're gonna go with the refer number 13.
and then just do the windshield wiper motion. Mm -hmm. All right. Actually, when I go in the big man pajama, the wrapper number 16, so that we're not here all day, but they got you. There we go. I'm talking about me and my big brand pajama brush, but that's all right. This brush gets the job done. Gets the job done. Yep, this brush gets the job done. some build that up a little bit more on this side so they look the same so they look like sisters all right and then and then we are going to go in with that uh, block number 13 and go in with, hmm, I'm gonna go in with Testify. All right, put that outer corner. Do y'all see how quick, <laughs> how quick we that applied? How pigmented. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The pigment. This is why I love color gray. The pigment. The absolute pigment. There it is. Get that on the other side in that corner. And this is not stamping. I'm just swooshing. A little bit because you don't need to stop like this all right all right you see her all right you see her all right add a little bit more on this side Swish, 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 swish. All right, that side doesn't need anything else. All righty dighty. And then, I think, am I going to go in with. I am going to take my refer number 14, number 14, and go in with Snitch. I don't know how this is gonna come out, y'all, but we about to see, we about to see. Ooh, ooh, snitches, ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, all right, snitch. All right. All right. snitch all right now that we went in with snitch let's take that and wipe off that wrapper number 14 and we are going to hit oh um all right we're going in Ooh, 
you know what? I'm gonna go in with my good old finger. Put her in the inner corner too. All right. Y'all see how? Okay. So I am going to go back over all of that. My big number 16. There we go, there we go. And yes, I realized I did not do a daggone thing with these eyebrows. But we're gonna come back to those, okay? All right, yeah, and I got them um, in the inner corner. All right. Now I'm going to do my lower lash line. Get that teeny tiny wrapper number 13, and I'm going to put um here, here, and then I'm gonna go back into the color grain palette. I'm gonna stick um over here out the way and take testify and bring that in here. Oh, and that popping it was here was the nice magnetic lid so that your shadows don't spill. All right. All right to dighty. And now I am going to line my eyes with. Uh, Am I gonna go with nocturnal or am I gonna go with translate? I'm gonna go with nocturnal. This is nocturnal. I'm gonna go with that. Now, I should have done swatches <laughs> on the hand. Let me go ahead and swatch these three for you all. Before I slap this on my eyes. All right, so we got Nocturnal. Uh, isn't that beautiful? And we got this is shooketh. Because let me tell you, all three of these had me shooketh. All right. And shooketh. All righty. And we've got translated. Translated. So when I got these and got them out the bottle and stuff, got them out the box, I did this, swatched them on my hands, and I couldn't stop looking at them. I could not stop looking at them. And here's the other pressed shadow that I got. This one is called No Way. Yeah. Yeah. So 
what we're going to do is we're going to take Nocturnal and line our eyes. All right, I'm doing this on camera at the request of my friend Toya. All right, we got our eyes done. And now after the fact, I'm gonna do my brows because I got this new brow filling, brow micro filling pen from Benefit. I bought this in the Sephora sale this past week. And I'm gonna, do my do my eyes so you guys see my brows are very sparse and that's from years of threading waxing plucking and the like and so they a little thin and I can't find my um, benefit brow pen I think I know where it is but I can't find it so we're going with our Fenty and excuse the fact that the cap is missing um, Brow MVP, and this is in soft black. Yeah, I can't, I lost this cap and I don't know where it is. All right, so I'm gonna brush them up. All right, do 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 do, and draw our line. Other line. Draw other lines, I should say. All right. So we've drawn our lines to guide us. And this one is in deep brown. Personally, I don't think it's dark enough, but we're gonna go with. Nothing. Shake it up, shake it up, shake it up, shake them. All right. nothing all right so this was a flop for me we can do the rest with the fancy and be done with it so i don't do the whole draw the line on the whole brow because I don't like the boxy look. I like a more natural look. Okay. 
I know. We have brows. Much better than last week's brows, I'd have to say. All right. So, now we are going to get into, now that the eyes, oh, wait, 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 wait. Back to the Dark Star Mascara. Or, actually, hmm, let's try this one. Let's try the Huda. So in my order, my Sephora order, I got this lovely sample of the Huda Beauty um, Legit Lashes. And one size is curl, one side is a volume. We're gonna start with the curl side first. Oh, how cute. Here's the one for the curl side. All right, that's the curl side. Actually, not bad. Let's go to the volume side. Hmm. FYI, this is the first Hood of Beauty product that I have tried ever. So... Would you look at that? And that's some volume. All right. You can see I have latches. <laughs> All righty tighty. I'll give it a good few more goes, but yeah, that seems like a winner. All right. And now, the Dusk Face Palette. So I got Dusk, even though I was tempted to get Midnight, even though Midnight was not made for me, but it looks so beautiful. I wanted to get it, but I got Dusk because Dusk is made for me. And we are going to, we are going to bronze, blush, and highlight. Shakita does not contour because I still haven't figured out. I still haven't figured that out. Also another magnetic one. I don't know why other people don't do the magnet. All right. So we are going to bronze with the ColourPop. Um, I forgot what brush this is it's not on the handle but it's in their basic brush set and we're going to bronze all right uh -oh. Also, know I promised you all the gray hair would be gone, but I haven't made the appropriate appointments for that to happen. So, you know, sue me. All right, we are bronzed. We are bronzed. All right. <sighs> this is the Eco Tools tapered highlight brush, which I'm going to, um, but first I am going to, I am going to figure out what I did with the blush brush. All right, we got the Eco Tools Precision Blush Brush, and we're going to go in with this cute little blush blush. Oh. 
okay. That's nice. Oops. All right, that's nice. You're real nice. Looks like I got a little color in my cheeks. I got a little color in my cheeks. I love how well it goes with my eyeshadow, which I'm still doing this. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, the highlight. All right. So I haven't done this in a while, but we about to, we're about to give it a go. Go ski. All right, that's enough of that. And let's see, for lips, I am going to just go with a gloss because the star of the show is at the eyes. And I am going to go in with my fave, Flash 4. And no liner. No nothing. And there we have it. And I'm gonna finish this look off with the new Pure Matte Mist Anti-Pollution Mattifying Satisfy. Why not? Can we get it open? Open. All right. Spray a little. <laughs> All right. Mm. Mm. Interesting smell. It smells like. Actually, it smells like charcoal soap. <laughs> um, not bad, but just you know. Mm. All right. All right, so here is the finished look. I think this turned out all right, if I do say so myself. Let me bring y'all a little, little closer, a little closer, a little closer, a little closer. Uh-huh. I don't look like Bozo the Clown. These eyes. Oh, gee. All right. That is that with that. Um, thank you all for watching. If you got this far, I really appreciate it. Um, please do subscribe. And please do tell all your friends that your crazy friend Shakita is out here making YouTube videos with all of those makeup looks that I've been posting on Instagram and Facebook. So, there you have it. Yep. Oh yeah. Sorry, I'm still looking at I'm still looking at these these eyes, y'all. Like, wait, what? Mm, did you see that? Oh, okay. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> thanks again. And thanks again for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.